What's up guys? So today we're gonna get the FDBRZ wrapped. season spec you know it's like a doing buggy style for a little too long this year because of seasons being so long um, but yeah finally uh, we're gonna get get it wrapped so I'm taking the car to uh, daily visual who has been wrapping my cars last five six years uh, they always do really good job um, so I'm actually almost alive in the shop um, yes yeah, so I will show you guys a little bit about daily visuals as well What's up, Josh? Hi, how, how are you? Good. You good? You? Yeah. I'm good. Okay. Right. Good. To see you. How are you? Good. So uh, I took, I brought the car. So can I bring in here or here? I think right here is gonna be the best spot. Okay. I'm gonna take it up for you, make room. So when you're ready, bring it on in, and I'll be ready for you. We'll park it right here. Cool. Cool. Do. Okay. We'll and just assemble everything on the car. I'll take the over fenders off, and then I'll go ahead and wrap each fender individually, and then okay. throw the over fenders back on. All right. That way we have a nice clean wrap underneath the over fenders. And everything is going to be solid, nice and white. Yeah. Basically, it looks like it's painted to the best of the ability that will make it look like it's painted. Um, but we'll make it look really clean. I mean, she needs some love, but we'll yes. Sure we're gonna give her some love. Need some clothes. It's been it's been naked for like too long. <laughs> <laughs> I know, it feels like it's been too long. Yeah. Sure. So, I mean, we're used to doing this back in, you know, March, middle of March, beginning of March. Yeah, but it's already June. It's June, it's just it's crazy. The new hasn't been shown anywhere yet. The Rocket Bunny, uh, Mura Sun, did it for us. But I have another one. This one with the CPR smithers. I know it's gonna be hard to stop. Nah, we'll handle it. Barely. I mean, if you're going for just straight gloss, that's just that's just straight Avery gloss white. Okay. So I decide to use this metallic white. Gloss white, gold sparkle. Oh wow. That's our official color. That's dope. It's not a championship white, but I think it's even cooler. So this right here is the coating that we're gonna use as well on the wrap. So we're okay. gonna go ahead and ceramic coat your wrap as well. That's gonna give it just more longevity over the lifespan of the year throughout racing. It's gonna clean oh, wow. a lot easier. It's gonna help the road debris, all the tar and the rubber. It's not gonna to wanna to stick to the wrap. It's gonna to wanna to wash and clean a whole lot easier after every race or just after every round. A quick okay, that's dope. Yeah, it's gonna clean Never had the service last year. 
<laughs> well, this is a new stuff. Okay, for us. fair enough. Started, but I mean, we've been doing ceramic coating on wraps for a little bit, for a while. Cool. I think it's just the best case to give it a shot and see what it does on a race car. Yeah, you know, it would really be great. We've never on a race car before. Okay. So. It'll be uh, our first time just running it through the season and see how well it does. So cool. I'll be looking forward to see. For I sure. think Mike Kojima will love it. Cool. So the line you can totally see and you can feel this side is really, really slick. Yeah. And this side is still kind of like sticky and it marks and it wears and tears a lot easier. Oh, uh, okay. Okay, so, and anything like water, any kind of like debris or anything like that, it just wants to wipe right off. And it stays for like at least a year or even more? Oh yeah, this is, so we put on a very high strength coating. Mm. Um, typically if you're doing a paint coating, this is like a three to five year coating on paint. That's oh wow, longevity. okay. So vinyl wrap, I am, we don't know exactly what the extensivity of how long it lasts on vinyl wrap. Yeah. But we have seen over the last couple years of doing vinyl wraps and mm -hmm. adding coating on it, the longevity of the lifespan of the wrap is extended far beyond beyond what it typically gets. Usually, oh, your wow. hood, like on your outdoor cars, your hood and your roof will only get maybe like two years maximum. Yeah. Uh, and then it's time to replace it on a wrap. With a ceramic coating, it'll give you an additional one to two years on mm. top of that, at least, is what we are finding. Okay. And as we go through time, we will basically see as we have been coating other cars, how well it's been performing, mm. whether it's three, four, or five years down the road, and these people are like, yeah, look at it, it's three years down the road, and my mm. wrap looks fantastic. Where usually at three years, you'll start to see signs of breakdown right the vinyl wrap and it'll be like brownie or starting mm -hmm. to look like it's rusting and that's basically like breakdown on the top toe so the ceramic coating it clogs all the pores of the vinyl hmm. so that way the top coat doesn't want to break down as fast gotcha so if you're washing it and cleaning it regularly the ceramic coating is still going to be on the surface of the wrap for hmm. the a very long time I would imagine for years as long as you're still washing it and cleaning it and maintaining it it'll work just as well as it would on a paint job all right Josh thanks a lot yeah. I will leave my lady to you um, <laughs> we'll take care of I know you do so uh, we'll see you in like a few days okay thank you Dad. thank you Later. hello Hi. Oh wow. That's good. Damn. So a little sizing adjustment right here. Right Josh? Just a little bit. <laughs> It's all coming together. New bumper. Yeah, right now I'm applying our ceramic coating basically. So this is a, a liquid coating to help prevent like staining um, the tire grease and uh, cling from like sticking to the wrap as much. Okay. Um, it's definitely gonna make the wrap like shinier. You can see the light coming off it. It's just, it's shinier. It has a lot more reflection yeah. and transition compared to a side that hasn't even been touched yet. And you can kind of see, it's probably yeah. hard to pick it up on camera. I'm sure not, but uh, yeah, I can see it. Yeah, in personal eye, you can totally yeah. see it. So, see, it doesn't, it doesn't work with the map coating then, like Matt Carter. Yeah, it, it does. It does? Uh-huh. Oh. Yeah, you can put oh. on that coating too. 
Uh, Mac surfaces. Nice. They actually recommend it more for matte surfaces because okay, because it, they stain easier. Yeah, you know? that's right. So the coatings will definitely help prevent it from staining. Can't wait to assemble everything. New wheels, tail lights, headlights. It will look super dope. So Josh, uh, how did it go for you? I, I, I really like it. Uh, I think it went really well. I really like it too. It looks fantastic. It came in looking like a misfit. <laughs> but now, it looks like it belongs to the family. Right? Yeah. It was pretty pretty bad, but uh, yeah, you guys made it. Oh, dude. Made it work, so. It looks, it looks like a true race car now. You know? Yeah. You take delivery and some, some sponsor logos and it yep. looks like a race car. You're right. Doing on social media and everything, but yeah, we can't wait to see you actually burning some rubber and <laughs> laying down some, uh, some smoke for sure. Cool, man. Thanks a lot, Josh. No problem, Dad. Anytime, man. Thank you. Thank you. So now the car is all done. Tail lights, all the body panels, new wheels. What else? Hoods on, headlights, new bumper piece. Looks great. So I'm gonna take this outside and see how that looks like. Right, Shaima? Right. Came out really good. Shiny. Still need one panel here, but everything else is all in one piece. New wheels. I liked it. I like the new look. Hope you guys do too.